welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, we will be reviewing the new Sephora favorites, Give Me Some Nude Lip Set. They do come out with these sets every so often. This is their newest edition. It did just release this past week. I was lucky enough to snag it up on a first access and we are gonna be doing swatches for you guys. So before we get started, if you are not already subscribed, please go ahead and hit that big red button. Uh, don't forget to hit the notification bell before you go so you can be notified of any future videos that I have. I normally upload every Monday and Friday. Um, you can also follow me on Instagram, Snapchat, and Twitter, and I'll have those linked down below for you guys. So if this is something that you definitely want to check out, then just keep watching. All right, so this is what the box looks like for this time around. Um, this is the Sephora Favorites. Give me some nude lip. I do like the fact that it has a little handle. And this box is actually a little bit smaller than the one they tried to do like this before. So I really do appreciate that it's not this big bulky box for all these lipsticks. And this one, you do get two full size and three minis. So I think it's really cool that you get two full size for $28. Um, the, now the Huda Beauty I know is $20. The Stila Liquid Lipstick is $22, so that's already $42. And the box is only $28 itself, so it very, very much pays for these boxes. If these are the brands that you're interested in trying, if they're the colors that you wanted to try, if this is something that interests you, they are a very good value. All right, so on the back of the box, it does say Lip Sampler, Fall's nudist edition to lip. This lip set offers a variety of options from matte lipsticks to a plumping lip gloss uh, to create the perfect nude pout. So um, once again, in this box, you get Makeup Forever, Stila, Tarte, Huda Beauty, and Buxom. So let's just go ahead and pop this open. Of course, it's got, you know, a bunch of these things that we all don't like. <laughs> all right, so the first item we have that I'm gonna pull out is the Makeup Forever. Um, this is in the color, I guess number 105. I guess um, Makeup Forever does by numbers. Ooh, that's pretty. So there's your swatch. All right. Now I'm not going to dip back in. Let's just see how much we can get out of this. All right. So there is your lip swatch. Um, kind of got like a a mauvey grayish undertone to this one so I actually kind of like it definitely doesn't go with this eye look <laughs> but I still like the color I would like to actually probably do a look in the future with this color um, yeah I like it all right so let's move on all right so going back into the box let's see what we got here Let's go ahead and do this Stila. So this is the Stila Stay All Day Liquid Lipstick, and this is in the color Caramello. So this is what the tube looks like. And let's give it a nice little swatch. It's on the... Mm, that looks really light. Kind of like a pinky nude. Um, so I don't know how that's going to work with my skin tone, but let's find out. All right, so that is one application. Um, same thing with the Makeup Forever. I was able to get one application out of it, even after a really nice swatch. So this is very nude <laughs> I don't know how I feel about it yet let's let it dry for a second I've actually never tried um, Stila liquid lip before so this is something very new to me okay so at first glance I thought it was gonna be too light but now that it's dried down I kind of like the color so it is very drying very drying on the lips not as much as I would say like a Kat Von D liquid lip I know those dry like really really bad but hmm 
looks to be transfer proof. The Makeup Forever was not going to be transfer proof. Okay, so I like that one. Let me go ahead and wipe this off and we will move on. All right, so let's try the Buxom and Dolly. Now I actually have had a sample size of this come from a Sephora plate and I really, really enjoy it. So I know I'm already gonna love this and I'm almost out. So I'm really happy that I got this one um, in here. All right. So as you can see on the swatch, it definitely has a sheen to it. I love the way that Buxom lip glosses feel. I like that light little tingle. Um, it's not painful whatsoever. It's just kind of like a refreshing tingle to it. Um, so this is a sheen lip gloss it's also supposed to be a plumping lip gloss but it does have a very slight hint of pink to it so i really really enjoy this this one usually stays in my purse i use it at work like all the time all the time um so so happy i got another one of these because i was gonna buy the full size but now i don't have to <laughs> All right, so next up, I have a Tarte Rainforest of the Sea lipstick. I know I just received one. What was it? I think it was in my Sephora as well. Um, it was any color I really wanted to try. I love that formula so much. And it just so happens that this is another color that I wanted to try. So I'm super excited that it was in here. This is in the color Beach Babe. I have a feeling that it just might be too light for me though so this is what it looks like it is very very tiny but I like to be able to see if I'm going to like it or not plus everything that we've received so far I've really enjoyed so it's okay that it's tiny Ooh, that really might be <laughs> way too light for me so there is your swatch right there okay so here is your lip swatch um i thought it was gonna be too light but i actually like the color i think i do um ah <laughs> i'm so excited i'm sorry i love these lipsticks so much but yeah I, like I said, I thought this was going to be too light, but I'm actually really, really digging this color. Okay. I'm not really kind of like a light peachy or a light pinky nude, but this is definitely making me change my mind. Okay. Super, super excited for this one. So that makes our last liquid lip, the Huda Beauty Lipstick. Um, and this ends in the shade Trendsetter. I don't think I have this one. Um, I think when I was shopping for Huda Beauty Liquid Lipsticks, I think this is one that I wanted, but they did not have it in stock. Now this is completely different from all the other ones. You'd see how there's kind of like mauve, pinky nudes, and this is more like a terracotta. So, All right, here we go. All right, so here is your lip swatch for this. Now this one's definitely more of a fall color to me in my book. Um, I could probably even do this one. I mean, of course you can wear any lipstick, any color that you want any time of the year. But as far as representing fall, I feel like this color definitely does that. Um, I like it. I like it, so. All right, let's go through all of the lipsticks. Okay, so here are all your swatches for all the lipsticks. I actually really enjoyed all the colors. Um, so for the Makeup Forever one, it does have kind of a strong smell, but it doesn't linger. It does not stay. I really enjoy the color. It's kind of like this grungy purple. 
Um, it felt really creamy going on the lips. And I do my, see myself using this in the future, so that is a plus. Um, the next one, we had the Stila Cosmetics. It actually ended up being a really pretty color. I did not think it was going to be, but I really, really enjoyed it. It definitely gives you that dry feeling on the lips. So if that is not your cup of tea, I definitely would not go for this. Um, we have the Buxom Lip Gloss, which I love so much. I cannot even stress how much I love these. Um, so like I said, super, super excited to have that. Then of course is the Tarte Rainforest of the Sea, which I put back on and I am really, really enjoying this color. I'm definitely going to have to put, purchase a full size. So I'm super excited that this was in here and the Huda Beauty, um, color is definitely a fall color so i will be pulling this out again i always enjoy her liquid lipstick formula so i'm super super happy that there was a full size in here and like i said you get two full size this right here is a 42 dollars and then your whole entire kit is only $28. So I think it's a really good value, a really good deal to try out different colors, different formulas. Like I said, lipsticks you've never tried, or if you've tried the lipstick, maybe colors that you haven't tried yet, so you don't have to go buy a full size. I didn't know if I was going to like the Tarte Rainforest of the Sea or not, um, but it turns out I really, really, really do like it, so I'm gonna have to go out and buy a full size. But once again it is in here it is a mini i can go ahead and finish and use this up so this worked for me this whole entire box worked for me i loved every single one of these so that is it for this review i hope you guys did enjoy please give it a big old thumbs up and i'll see you guys on my next video bye